So what we're doing is putting this horse under anesthesia so we could remove chip fragments from his joints. The horse was exercising and some of the most common problems that a high, high level equine athlete has is that they start developing, they could develop chip fragments um, in the joint. What we do then, we remove them and usually they have excellent prognosis, especially like this horse, which is gonna be in the fetlock of the hind end and the fetlock in the front end. Excellent prognosis. So what I'm doing here is helping, helping Damien prepare the horse for anesthesia. And I have realized that over the, over the years, I have realized that there's no too big or too small of a job if you're helping your team, right? Like, I know I have seen some, some people that say, oh yeah, I'm not gonna scrub. I'm not gonna pick up poop. That's not my job. But you know what, in reality, your letters, having your letters of DVM, VMD, whatever it is, doesn't really make you not being part of the team. So one of the things that I enjoy the most is actually being part of the team. Not because I am a veterinarian, I'm gonna say, I'm not going to scrub that joint. I'm not gonna pick up that poop. I'm not going to help out, you know? So this is gonna be the point of entry. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna focus my scrubbing right there at the point of entry. Contact time is very important. And you see, I am not going to move any further higher, which look what I'm gonna do right now. After I'm satisfied with this, I'm gonna move up. And when I move up, I'm just gonna throw it away because now I took the bacteria from here all the way up. And I'm gonna start doing the same again. And we're gonna do that for five, six minutes, whatever it takes to get it clean. And then Damien is gonna come back and it's gonna do a super mega sterile preparation. He's entering in the, in the joint right now with that needle. As you can see that he's gonna use that as a guide. How big is that fragment? Uh, it's pretty good size. That's uh, the end of my pinky finger. We bought the horse with this piece. Oh, it was purchased like that? Yeah. But it was lame when they purchased it no. or not? No. No, he's won quite a few shows and now he's finally thrown a suspension grant. Oh. So, since it's for the brand, we're going to clean it up now.
Beautiful. So there they just suspensories. This was the fragment. Right there. That's the fragment. That same fragment, we can see it right there. Right there. That little piece right there. And then that's the fragment right there. Another view. And then after surgery, it looks like that. No mm. fragment. So we have removed the whole thing. The fragment right there. You can probably zoom in. Mm. It's the one that he's gonna go and remove right now. Mm. So he already removed the one on the hind ankle that was attached to a suspensory and was actually causing lameness. Now he's going to go to the left one, which is in risk of causing lameness as well. So the, in the front, he's going to remove a P1 fragment, P1 fragment. Yeah, right there, you can see the needle getting into view. That's our puppy. Surgery was finished, it was a complete success. We removed a chip from the hind ankle and a chip from the front ankle. Prognosis is great. And now, time to rehab this horse.